Hey guys, what's up? So you might notice that there is a second Gabronth in this picture. That is because um, I went back the next morning and I was bored and I threw like two more rare summon tickets at that banner. And don't you worry, Balthier didn't dare show up, but the Neo Vision did, again. Um, I suppose only a giant a-hole would complain about that. And I am no giant a-hole, so I will not complain about it at all. Um, but that's why he's here, and yeah, that's why I also still don't have a uh, new vision of the end of that too. But, um, anyhow, um, I had a really embarrassing dream, uh, the other night. Dreams are so stupid, like, when you try and tell people about your dreams, it's, like, probably the most boring thing ever. Um, nobody really wants to hear it, but this one was kind of funny, because I was sitting there, um, I guess I had, like, transferred to a, another end of the country or something, and um, they had me signing up for school. And so I was like signing up, I was like at the administration office trying to choose classes and I was like, really, I've got to take P in 12th grade? Oh man, this is the worst. And then like my brain was like, just not loving it, not happy about it. And then like searching and searching and then it like recalled this photo that I have uh, graduating from high school with a couple of my friends, like an in, in real life photo. And um, it was like, wait a second, hold up. I do not need to go to school. I do not need to sign up for 12th grade PE because I graduated high school. So take that stupid dream. And um, I, I like marched out of the administration office and you know went, went back on to whatever odd things were happening in that dream. Like it was just a ton of snakes in this apartment that I was at. Uh, and then there's a giant like orange crab wandered in. I was trying to get rid of it. Didn't know where it went. It like was hiding. And then all of a sudden I found it later in my slow cooker all sizzled up. Anyway, it was a very, very bizarre dream, but it did remind me, I don't know if you've seen Top Secret um, with Val Kilmer, um, but he has a moment where he's in a dream and he's back in high school and then he wakes up and he's being tortured and he's just like, ah, oh, so happy. Um, now I didn't wake up being flogged, but I was also happy that, yeah, I did not need to go back to high school and take uh, PE in 12th grade because that would have been terrible. All right. Stupid, stupid. Let's move on to the news. Gosh, whatever. Um, let's see what we got going on. Um, known issues. Uh, is this old or just new? I don't know. Well, no, updated 10.6, so it's fairly new. Well, they're apologizing for the inconvenience these issues may have caused, which is always a great way to start. The team is currently investigating and will respond to each issue in a timely manner. Thanks for understanding. Well, today's issue is a visual issue whereby players who have crafted the quarter Hasame scroll will continue to see the new icon displayed in the crafting menu. Oh my gosh, that's so irritating. It's like red bubbles, right? Um, no, it's not new. I know it's not new. And, but the game's like, no, it's new. Um, and you basically end up going crazy. Yeah, okay, well, please work on that. Um, all right, what do we have here? Oh, hey, so I looked into this last week. Uh, this um, this is actually pronounced maintenance, and uh, it will be performed on Wednesday. It just means that they're going to be, you know, they're working on a couple things. They're going to uh, maybe bring out a new banner or something, and, and there's new content coming your way. So, guys, just hold tight. Um, it's really not a big deal. It's going to happen on Wednesday overnight through Thursday morning. Um, you can't play the game. But stuff's going to come your way, and I promise, you know, um, it's worth the while. Worth the wait, I should say. Um, bundle updates. Well, hooray, uh, they're going to be revamping a few of the bundles um, that you can find in the shop. The one featured right here, the weekly booster bundle, for just a mere 500 lapis, um, will consist of a rare summon ticket, um, a trust wiggle, my best friend, of course, that max level king metal minotaur, times three. Wow, uh, not too shabby at all. Energy restores, raid restores. Um, I saw one of those for the first time in my life uh, a couple months ago. And equipment enhancement or restores as well. And then here we have a 2000 lapis bundle, um, which will consist of a new Vision EX ticket, the five star version. Wow. Uh, five star Trust Moogle, 50%, 10 of my best friends, and two STMR exchange tickets. Um, interesting i always like seeing some uh, some lapis bundles over over the dollar bundles even though i mean you could argue it's the same kind of a thing it's all currency right or whatever 
just a fortification for six dollars and 99 cents now that will consist of a lot of things a lot of fortisites i'm not going to read through them you go look but uh 20 of my best friends wow a million and a half gill uh why did i read this backwards from the ground up sorry um, and then a four star, five star Neo Vision EX ticket. Um, or you can just kind of look in that picture and that would have said everything that I was about to say right there. Um, what else have we got? Vengeful Arms login bonus. Here is where we learn the news of the week. And it looks like it will be um, Ferion, the Neo Vision version, and Dark Knight Leon. All right, so he'll be the MVA, I assume. Um, oh, an Emperor as well. Um, fragments for him. And Eileen. Wow, a lot going on this week as far as um, Neo Vision Awakenable uh, units go. All right, let's read on. An exchange shop will be here for Final Fantasy II slash FFBE. And available from Thursday 10 8, you can exchange summon coins. Um, for all of these wonderful prizes. Now you can obtain them by performing 11 summons from the Final Fantasy II featured summon banner. And then head over there to exchange for fragments uh, for these people. Oh, thoughtful sister Maria. That's kind of cute. Um, Ascension, Transcension Pearls, tickets, best friends, Gil Sniper families, uh, all that, all that fun stuff. Okay, well, player's choice. Ah, the free weekly 10 summon that we all chose. Well, we didn't all choose it. I chose it, and I won. So, um, I'm going to be looking forward to this. I hope you all have some good luck with it, but it will be here. Um, end of maintenance 10 8, and we'll get four weeks. Um, and there's the dates there, so you can put it in your calendar and never forget um, to do them because then it'll be sad. Even if even if you just do get um, a, fun, a bunch of blues, but. Um, hey, it could be good. You never know. All right, 45 million downloads, celebration, special campaigns will be held to commemorate this landmark moment in FFBE. Uh, log in every day and receive amazing rewards like, um, what? A five-star guaranteed 10 plus one ticket. Um, some lapis, a select summon ticket. More lapis, more lapis. Ooh, lots of lapis. I like all that lapis. All right, uh, NVEX ticket, five star. Select summon ticket, another five star. More lapis, more and more and more and more lapis. That's pretty great. And then also enjoy half energy, which absolutely is what I need right now. Sorry, I have got to finish the story. And, um, well, not the story, but season two. I really need to because the revisit is like knocking on my door and probably soon uh, gonna haunt my dreams in some bizarre version of it. Um, and so yeah, I need, to, I need to finish it and then find out what happens and move on to season three, which I can't wait to find out um, who all those girls are and have fun with them and Fina. But um, enough about me. Use this time for half energy to do whatever you gotta do, whether it's a catch up in story or um, do your revisit or whatever. But starting and maintenance on Thursday, through Wednesday 11 4 um, you can you can grind that story for for half the cost so be excited as well as for amazing enhancements which is always always fun as well especially after those that that kind of like weird Elena wave raid battle thingy um, and then the other regular raid uh, I hope you have a lot of cactars right now so go use this time to make some of my best friends that's end of maintenance Thursday 10 8 through Wednesday 11 14 Please rest assured that although the enhanced units label says increased great success rate, both great and amazing success rates have been increased. So, um, they don't always put all the words necessary. You just gotta infer sometimes um, because it would be very, very busy on the screen if they wrote the entire um, sentence. So, um, that's just, that's all. Don't get offended. All right, all chambers are open um, for Chamber of Gems, Chamber of Awakening, Chamber of Experience, Chamber of Riches, Chamber of Creation, and Chamber of Crystals. So if anyone still does those, um, just kidding, of course you do them, right? Uh, I don't know. You're awesome if you do. Um, they will be open for free. Well, no, not for free. They probably cost energy. But they'll be open um, from end of maintenance, Thursday 10, 8, through start of maintenance, 11, 4. Um, oh shoot, have I been saying 11.14? Oh, I have. 
I'm giving out so much false information. All right, so um, roll back what I said about amazing enhancements and half energy. You only have until 11.4, not 11.14, because um, somebody's been lying to you. All right, equipment enhancement event. Wow, this is gonna be a busy week. Um, this will be here. Um, doesn't look like we have any dumb weapon that they want us to focus on. Um, so that's kind of fun. I honestly prefer it when we can just focus on the, the weapons that we're, um, that we're excited about. And I just made a bunch of STMRs recently when uh, it was half ill. Uh, just some things that have been kind of sitting around and I hadn't been like totally, totally excited about. But most of them, I would say the majority of the STMRs I made were weapons. So this is going to be a great opportunity for me to um, get some awesome stats on some weapons that I don't use. So I hope you take the opportunity to do that as well. And hopefully you use them. Um, don't ever be like me. But from Anime Maintenance Thursday 10 a through Starter Maintenance Wednesday 10 21, which actually happens to be a birthday that I know very well, um, select the equipment you wish to enhance, create a party, not my birthday, don't worry, don't wish me happy birthday, um, and bring a friend along to the dungeon. Uh, why am I still talking about this? You know how this works. Get in there. Get some good abilities hopefully the drop rate is fantastic and not um, as disagreeable as it's been uh, kind of in the past but um go get some of that stuff and um and get your weapons all super strong all right the steel dummy oh this is like the guy in the uh, vortex that you kind of like fight to see how good your your chaining is or not um well he's going to be actually a highly difficult quest He's not uh, like the other dummy. This guy's made of steel. And you gotta defeat it as quickly as you can to win attractive rewards. So let's find out some info from our good friend. Um, the steel dummy is a mocking dummy. Oh man, that's not cool. I do not like being mocked, especially by a dummy. Uh, but he is capable of withstanding significant amounts of damage. Well, we'll see. Uh, dummy up, you dummy. Uh, as it is immune to all parameter reductions and ailments, the best way to defeat it is with your strongest elemental attackers. Kubo. Ugh. Well, alright, fine. I'll do what I gotta do to make a mockery of this dummy who's trying to make a mockery out of me. Uh, mission rewards will be 50 lapis. Um, turn challenge medals. Um, which we will do what with? Well, we're going to trade them in for items in the exchange shop um, for turn challenge. Like the yin yang dual hand. I'm not going to read all these. Beach girls, winged heart. Oh, check it out. We've got some um, interesting STMRs in here that you can just buy. Well, um, interesting indeed. Uh, all right. Well, yeah. Uh, get in on that dummy and dummy them up and, and go buy yourself some STMRs, man. That's awesome. Vision cards have arrived. Um, new ones, I should say. Battle with the Black Knights. Oh, wow. Yeah, quite a fan of, um, of these little things. Um, can't wait to see some Final Fantasy 15 ones, though. Um, Final Fantasy 6, of course. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get stuck up for those. Battle with the Black Knights will give you, ooh, some massive boost to your attack. 50 flat attack at level one, and then 90 flat attack at level 10 with an extra boost of 20% with equipped by a sword, axe, or spear um, at level 4, while boosting your attack by 40% when equipped with a bow. Level 7 looks to have the same exact uh, boosts, um, or I guess, no, it's just an additional, additional, uh, yeah, overcoming sadness. Uh, unyielding heart at level 10 will let you escape death on time when HP is above a certain point, if you're putting this on a Final Fantasy 2 unit. And then a new journey. Um, I was pretty sure we saw this cute little thing before, but um, if not, uh, level 1, you'll get spirit boost of 50. Level 10, a flat boost of 80. Uh, as well as some fire, ice, and light resistance of 10%. At level 4, an additional at level 7. And 20% uh, more at level 10. Yeah, we did look at these before. And then again, escape death one time when HP is above a certain point. Alright, so... Right? That's not just deja vu. I totally read this last week. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, Alright, unit intro quest. Alright, we have Furion in his Neo-Vision form. He's a young man who joins the rebel army to defeat the Palamecian Empire, which destroyed his homeland. His friend Leon also survives the fall of Finn, 
but now stands against him as a key member of the Palmistian army. Ugh, so much intrigue. All right, uh, end of maintenance Thursday through start of maintenance Wednesday 1021. You'll be able to try him out um, and see his CG Limit Burst move slash movie, which you will have to toggle your um, Limit Burst on um, in order to view and then quickly turn it back off um, when you're done. So, Lapis times 50, Ghost Snapper Family times 3, Mini Power Pots and Star Quartz for just taking him for a whirl. Um, next, Leviathan. You tried to give it all away, didn't you, my friend? Well, I'm too quick for you. Final Fantasy 2 Event Dungeon Leviathan will give us a chance to get a 5-star Select Summon ticket, um, as well as a 7-star unit, Minwoo. Um, play the event, get Minwoo, which also... Uh, implies that this is a King Mog event. Um, I haven't had to scrape up a bunch of currency for that greedy guy in, I don't know, almost seven days. So um, we're back to doing that um, and saving away, but uh, at least we get Minu with his STMR, the ultimate seeker of magic, a materia that boosts MP and spirit by 20%, fills the LB gauge every turn, as well as boosts spirit by 30% when equipped with staff. So hey, um, you get excited? Uh, I suppose, and Trust Max Reward will be Minwoo's Turban, a hat with Defense 8, Magic 23, Spirit 34, and a boost to Fire and Light Resistance by 25%. Um, he's got some abilities like Triple White Mage's Strength, uh, so he can triple cast or triple whatever he's doing, uh, and then do a couple of things like, I don't know, uh, kill himself to automatically revive an ally, while filling the LBH to max and boosting LB damage for that that ally, I'm assuming, um, not an additional one, but uh, I could be wrong. Um, so if you kind of got bored sacrificing Rum, well, here's a new guy that wants to be sacrificed, and his name's Minwoo. Uh, guarding Light of Mysidia will boost your magic and spirit. So yeah, it kind of looks like he is a support, which actually you should have seen right there um, in the type. So um, if you didn't, you have me here to tell you, so you're welcome. ProQuest gives you Minwoo's shield, um, ELT will give you trust removal from Minwoo, 50%, and Legend Quest will give you 50% of Minwoo's STMR. And then next, you can have access to some event-exclusive equipment, which you may or may not be excited about, but that's the Gaia Blade, a sword with attack 110, and the Gaia Blade Plus with attack 131, as well as Heavyweight Killer. Boost physical damage against heavyweights, uh, just getting beasts, demons, dragons, and stone monsters. Or how about the Dark Bow with attack 101, spirit 50, and chance of inflicting blind. And if you don't like that, don't settle. Get the Dark Bow Plus with attack 118 and spirit 78, and still have the chance of inflicting blind. Uh, cool. Then that shield is meh, but hey, check out below it and you'll see Minwoo's Shield Plus, which is defense 48, spirit 53, as well as a 20% boost to spirit. So, yeah, look them over, see what you think, um, get some exchange tickets, because we love to have UOCs, even if we're told not to use them to get uh, the Balthiers that you want so badly, but, you know, hey, um, thanks for your advice, guys. Uh, Round Worm and Golden Bomb and King Golden Bomb will also be there, so that you can get a lot of torches. And thank goodness we have Mog here to give us some advice. Um, all right, I gotta commit this to memory. Uh, Stone Killer is effective against Round Worms. Um, all right, I might be able to find some of that. Um, Demon Killer is effective against Golden Bombs and King Golden Bombs, Kubo. So um, I'm gonna have to take a look at my gear uh, and see how I can work that because I definitely, definitely want to get a lot of torches and take these guys down huh, if I can. All right, um, parameter boost for these guys, but um, more importantly, character bonuses um, when you bring along the crew at the top, Neo Vision Furion. Uh, Awakened Emperor, Dark Knight Leon, and Eileen. 200% uh, for um, Fancy Maria and Min Wu. 100% for their six star version. 60% for these seven stars. 30% for their six star forms, or five star, I guess, for Dark Knight Leon, but not the others. These pictures are so bizarre. 20% for these sad sacks, and 10%. Ooh, they're really diving deep. All right, uh, let's see, you can get some maps in the exchange shop as well. And then, hey, do the daily bonus challenge against the round worm if you can. Um, it's limited to Final Fantasy II units, but if you clear it, 
um, you'll be able to grab an NVEX ticket, five star version, the four star, five star version, and the three star, four star, five star New Vision version as well. Um, but these are the only people you can take. So good luck to you. Um, I hope your party is not just a bunch of guys. Get it? Got it. Yeah. All right. Um, challenge of the brave. Caught between virtues and vices. Uh, all right, obtain awakening materials from your vision's brave abilities by taking this challenge on. Um, definitely want to do that if you pull any of these guys or build any of these guys or make whatever you, you do to, to, you know, whatever. Um, so get in on that. Uh, or instead, uh, check out the Piercing Conviction challenge to get some brave insignias for um, Awakened Dragon Axe Star, Pyroclacial Last Wall, and Eileen. So make sure you're doing the right one based on who you're trying to work on. Um, it's not my fault if you get it backwards. Waste your time. All right, Featured Summon is going to look like this for Final Fantasy II. Bunch of units getting some new looks. Um, starting October 8th, there will be apparently a major boost to drop rates, although don't expect to get Balthier off the banner. Um, well, although, yeah, maybe you will. Maybe on this one you will. Certainly not on his. Um, and then obtain some summon coins. The panel summon will be there if your summon even likes that. Um, and yeah, it's pretty much the same as we've seen in the past. Neo Vision Furion. Here he looks, and there's his Brave Shift Sprite. Alright, um, his STMR will be a two handed bow with attack 180, activates Wild Rose Archer, which boosts physical damage against avian monsters, boosts LB damage, and boosts equipment attack when a single weapon is equipped in both hands. Alright, uh, his Trust Master rewards a Thorn of Rose, a materia that boosts attack by 30% when equipped with a sword, axe, or spear, and attack by 60% when equipped with a bow. Nice. Alright, his vision card will be Battle with the Black Knights, which we already talked about, so I won't talk about it again. And he's got abilities, and you're gonna look at them and do what you think. No, no, no. Somebody else will tell you if they're good or not, not me. Um, Emperor, let's check out his Brave Shift. Oh, nice. Looks like he just, like, switched his uh, scepter to the other side. But I get it. You gotta juggle it between hands so that one shoulder doesn't get sore. Uh, that's true. Um, he will have the same things that we've seen before, except for now some Brave Shift abilities. Dark Knight Leon. Looking a little bit more menacing in his Brave Shift. Uh, same things here, some abilities that somebody else is going to talk to you about. Um, Eileen, I want to see hers. Alright. Not that much different either, just kind of a different uh, weapon pose. Um, and all that kind of stuff is the same, some Brave Shift moves. Uh, thoughtful Sister Maria, now we can pause and look at you. STMR is determined to defeat the Empire, a materia that boosts defense and spirit by 40%, while nullifying poison, blind sleep, silence, paralysis, confusion, disease, and stone, while boosting LB gauge fill rate. Nice. Ribbon effect on that, um, with some defense and spirit boosts. Um, Trust Master reward will be Yochi's Bow, Attack 126, Spirit 148, Two-Handed Weapon, which activates Bow of the Rebellion, boosts physical and magic damage against Avion monsters. All right. She's got some moves as well. Read into them. Um, you'll figure out later if they are worth your while. Um, but yeah, it definitely looks like she's got some kind of white mage things here with that auto revive. Um, but yeah, I'm not here to tell you. I don't know whether to pull or not. If you love Final Fantasy II, um, that's on you. All right. Um, I am going to wrap this up with a really quick uh, summon. Yeah, I know this is silly, right? But I just want to do my other lap on this because uh, they're just kind of fun and I haven't done the revisit yet and it doesn't look like there's anybody I really am going to spend uh, on this week. I am saving for Halloween because it's my, my favorite. Well, no, it's, well, I just love it. Um, I'm not going to explain to you what my favorite stuff. Okay, cool. Great. Um, this is number two for me. I actually used my free choice when we had to choose like a some unit of semi-recent uh, past. I don't know. And she was the one I chose, so here's my second version, so she can now be a seven star. Sweet. All right, let's see what we got here. Sorry for slamming my wine. Um, so in my first lap of this, um, I got one Neovision, and that was Air, um, which I was really happy about. Okay, that is my fourth Cirque, what do you guys like to call that thing? Um, anyway, fourth, well, no, eighth, I should say. So this will be a second STMR. 
Um, unless I'm supposed to hold on in case uh, he gets a, or she gets it gets a NBA. I don't know. Um, and then HT lid, maybe my form. I don't know. Um, all right, last one. Let's see how it goes. And then, um, and then I'm back to saving Lapis for sure. Be okay if I got about the year. I'd really be okay with it. Oh, Fina and Dark Fina. This is like the only version of Fina that I did not have. Welcome, girls. Oh, Ignis, that might be. Oh, oh wow. Nice. Get on in here, Tifa from Advent Children. I love getting new units. That's fun. Okay, Morgana, you're like number five. But Ignis, I think you might be, I don't know, something for me. Um, yeah, I'm not going to talk about uh, Lois Mitchina or um, Jake. But, um, all right, cool. Glad I did it. It's fun. And those uh, select summon tickets. I should probably just use them on that beer. I mean, come on. It's getting ridiculous. All right. Um, that's that. Uh, tell me if you're so excited for Final Fantasy 2 because it's your absolute favorite. And then, um, and then, well, I'll raise, eh, well, actually, I can't raise my eyebrow. That's not a skill I have. Um, but it's cool. You like what you like? No, fine. Okay. All right. Um, enough. I'm going to stop and I'm going to say my awkward goodbye. And thanks for hanging out. And as always, cheers.